Hi, I'm Roger Mansfield. I'm a professional driver with Bison Transport, and I'm also on the Driver's Advisory Board, and today we are uh, demonstrating the AutoSock traction control device. So the AutoSocks were developed a couple of years ago in Scandinavia, and they're basically pretty new on the market in North America as a textile alternative traction control device that's meant to replace chains and not a lot is known about them so we're testing them this winter to see how durable they are and to see how effective they are uh, out on the roads. One of the main advantages uh, for the auto socks over the chains is uh, they're very easy to put on. Uh, basically you just put as much of the fabric on the outer drive tires um, as you can covering the top and the bottom and then you just move the vehicle forward a couple of feet and come back and flip on the last part so it covers the entire tire. You don't even have to worry if they're not straight. As you drive down the highway, they will straighten themselves out. Um, they have an elastic on the inside which pulls tight and keeps them snug onto the outer drive tire. Taking them off, even easier than taking them on. It really, you just tear them off. Nothing to it. And then you just drive over and pull them out from underneath the tire. So I do a lot of the driving in the uh, BC Mountains, uh, Kootenai Pass, Rogers Pass, the Coquihalla, and uh, there's some challenging conditions, heavy wet snow, and that's where I find the uh, auto socks uh, perform really well. Most often chain up, chain up areas are just on a small cutout. It's a very dangerous spot. There's traffic going by, the roads are bad and slippery. Um, with the auto socks, I can put these on in 10 minutes or under, whereas a set of chains can take anywhere from 30 to 45 minutes. So if we can reduce the amount of time that a driver is outside of the vehicle installing a traction control device, we're actually helping their safety, which is something that Bice is very interested in. They're not for every application. Uh, a really heavy haul uh, trucking company or um, somebody, a uh, Super B hauling lumber, they might want chains. The chains do dig better uh, than the auto socks, but for what we do, hauling vans, reefers, medium weights, they perform really well. Obviously another benefit for the auto socks is they're very lightweight. Compared to a set of chains, a chain hanger mounted on the side of the frame rail, these are really textile fabric. They weigh nothing. You can put them back in the bag they came in, store them underneath your bunk. Um, so there's a significant weight difference. Bison is always trying to look for ways that we can reduce weight on our tractors. Uh, number one, for fuel efficiency, and number two, so we can increase the, the payload of our customers. So anytime that we can find weight savings, like with the auto socks, that's also a benefit for us. There is still some questions about uh, durability on the auto socks. We want to keep testing them over a couple of seasons to see how they hold up over time. Some of the problems with the auto socks is you can chew them up because they are textile. Uh, if you drive on bare pavement or if there's bare patches, a lot of times the chain ups will be on at the bottom of the hill and there will be a large section of bare pavement before you get to where the snow is accumulating. So you really have to crawl when you're on bare pavement so that you don't uh, chew up the fabric because once you chew them up, they become ineffective and need to be replaced. So we're going to continue to test them throughout uh, the rest of the winter and, and next winter as well and see how they hold up over time. I personally really think that they're effective. Uh, once you start using the auto socks, you don't want to go back to using chains. For me, I'm sold and I would recommend them to be used more company-wide, but again, we'll, we'll keep testing them and we'll, we'll see how they do in the long term.